Hello and welcome back. Back at it. We are on our journey to the Greybeards. We have defeated the Frost, Frost Troll. Kind of cheese them, but I don't care. Kill is a kill. Ah, but I finally hope. I think we are close. I can't remember any more bigger enemies on top of my head. Maybe some more wolves, but compared to the frost roll, I think peanuts. I couldn't care less to read the emblems <laughs> because I just want to reach there. It's been two episodes and I just want to reach them. Maybe some more ice wraiths. Would be cool if they included nice. Would be cool if they included some special perks for different armor. For example, on top of the mountains where it's pretty cold. Fur armor should be advantageous by being more cold resistant than Let's say, yeah, this is the food the people bring to them. Excuse me, to me. <laughs> Empty chest. So I'm, so I'm late to the party. And there's two entrances. I take the right one. I don't care. Shouldn't make any difference. Hello. Hello, Mr. So, Angaya. A dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. Mm -hmm. We will see you. Show us, dragonborn. Let us taste oh. of your voice. Boost! Shout at us. Let us taste okay. of your voice. Shout at you. Are you ready for it? Strike us with the power of your voice. I shall. Boost! Uh. Uh. Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. Hello to you, sir. I am must. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? I'm answering we your summons, master. To welcome a Dragonborn I am the real Bulwaki. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in full. That is for you to discover. We can show you the way, but not your I can show you the way. We are the Greybeard. You stand in High Hrothgar. The way of the, the voice. Of Kinarith's sacred mountain. Here we commune with the voice of the sky and strive to achieve balance between our inner and outer selves. We are here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed. Whether you are the only dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. Interesting. You have shown that you are dragonborn. You have. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. Hell Without yeah, training, you're right. You have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum, a shout. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. When you shout, speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. Okay. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, a second word in unrelenting force. 
Control means balance in the tongue. Combine it with fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharply. That is how the rest of us learn and shout. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As okay. part of your initiation, Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding of Rome. Okay, so he's the equivalent of a dragon shrine now where we obtain. You can master your new thought. your unrelenting force shout to strike the targets as they appear. Which targets? Mm -hmm. Noise. And the cooldown has gone up, I think. Well done. Again. Okay, the longer we hold it... Meow. <laughs> you learn quickly. Once more. Mm -hmm. Who are you? And bless you. Impressive. Your thumb is precise. Thank you, Master Yoda. Great promise, Dragonborn. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Bori. Bori, where you at, bro? But before I go there, I will check out what you have started for me. Anything of value you like to read, apparently. Okay. Oh, it's stealing, okay. I think you drink a bit too much wine. Best decision they made. Just exile themselves and have a blast every night. Best idea. Hey yo, who's the one who had the idea, bro? Can I join? Since it's stealing, I will just finish the quest. Maybe after that I'm able to steal <laughs> the stuff for free. We will now see how you learn a completely new shout. Mm -hmm. Master Bori will teach you Wuld, which means whirlwind. Wuld. Wuld, you do that too? Ha! Must hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thumb. Mm -hmm. Approach Master Bori and he will give you his name Wolf. Thank you. Now we will see how quickly you can master. But I think I have to equip it first. Okay, so there is a recharge timer. You shot. Master Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. Master Bori, 
Easy. Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. Couldn't bother to open the door your for me once again. Your quick mastery of a new thume is... Uh, Astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself? You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jürgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrad. Remain true to the way of the voice, and you will return. I will most definitely return, bro. Let's check out some law. No doubt, the appearance of a dragonborn at this time is not an accident. Your destiny is surely bound up with the return of the dragons. You should focus on honing your voice, and soon your path will be made clear. Surely there is, there is more you can tell. There is much that we know that you do not. That does not mean that you are ready to understand it. Excuse me? Do not let That's your me easy mastery of the voice tempt you into the arrogance of power. That has been the downfall of many dragonborn before you. Hmm. He was a great war leader of the ancient Nords, a master of the voice or tongue. After the disaster at Red Mountain, where the Nord army was annihilated, he spent many Who can't years remember the disaster in Red Mountain, right? Defeat. He finally came to realize that the gods had punished the Nords for their arrogance. He was the first to understand that the voice should be used solely for the glory and worship of the gods, not the glory of men. Jürgen Windcaller's mastery of the voice eventually overcame all opposition and the way of the voice. Was born. I can show you the way. No doubt, the appearance of a dragon born at this time. Okay. You should focus on honing your voice. I know. And soon, you dragons have already. the inborn ability to learn and project their voice. Dragons also are in a few mortals are born with similar abilities, whether a gift or a curse. As what you have already learned in a few days took. Even the most gifted of us years to achieve. Some believe that dragonborn are sent into the world by the gods at times of great need. We will speak more of that later, when you are ready. The voice was a gift of the goddess Kimmer at the dawn of time. Although this gift has often been misused, true mastery of the voice can only be achieved in the contemplation of the sky, Kinnereth's domain, and the practice of the voice, we strive to achieve this balance. That is commendable. Let's not. But remember, the dragon blood is itself a gift of Akatosh. Do not try to deny that gift. Your destiny requires you to use your voice. Why else would Akatosh have bestowed? Maybe this it's power a mutation, bro. If you remember to use your voice in service to the purpose of Akatosh, you will remain true to the way. I can show you the way. I think that's it. Sky, jump. Thank you. Oh, where are the other ones? Okay. But now I will check if I get some goodies. Maybe some potion, maybe some thought. Why is this floating? And why are you running? Ah, still stealing. Sedge. Yeah, why should I go back here if I can just fast travel from here? 
All right. Where is this? <laughs> of course. Yeah. Most definitely not going there. For now. And this. Where are you? <laughs> of course it is. Of course. So, oh, one good. What? Next DLC. You there. You're the one they call Dragonborn. Excuse me? Uh, what are Your you talking about? Your lies fall on deaf ears, Deceiver. We know you are the false Dragonborn. You shall not stand in the way of the true Dragonborn's return. He comes soon, and we shall offer him your heart. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. Okay. I don't want to hit the guard. One guard down. A guard, okay. Only a guard. All of these different Armors. Heavy armor only gives 19. Bruh. But this looks gorgeous. Frost room. Nice. Maybe I will take them. Just have them in my inventory. And the next DLC, I think. What do you have for me? Cultist order. Read it, and I think then I call it for it. The cultist order. C. Yes. <coughs> Can this travel? But the vessel Northern Maiden docked at Raven Rock. Take it to Windhelm, then begin your search. Curl the false dragonborn known as. TDXC before we reach a solstice. Return with word of your success. Mirak shall be most pleased. Okay. Wow. At least it's not. You look a bit pale, bro. Can I eat you? Yeet! <laughs> I think this is it for this episode. It's been 90 minutes. Ah, uh, we have done the first. Quest for the Dragonborn or the Greybeards. I thank you very much, and I hope I see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>